The year is 1953. The young engineer designer uh, Jan Vilskård has just been recruited to Volvo. He's to be a legendary chief designer who's responsible for all the design for 40 years up to 1990. This is his first project that he's working on. Uh, it's called the Philip, a Volvo Philip, a prototype which is quite unique. The idea was to have a larger car than the 444 that uh, we were selling. As you can see, this is a very American design. Uh, it reminds us of a Kaiser very much. Now, it's unique because it has under the bonnet a V8 engine. So this is the V8 engine, later known as B36. Uh, it was used in Volvo Snubber as a truck at the time. It's petrol uh, driven and it's 120 brake horsepowers. The interior and the front seat is a full sofa. Of course, seat belts weren't at all, you know, were used at the time. You see the boomerang pattern also on the sofa and the same is actually in the hub of the steering wheel. Again, as you can see from the front, it's a front that is designed that is inspired from the American cars at the time. It hasn't got a lot of Volvo identification on it. There's a V on the bonnet, but it's certainly got the grille, which gives it the very much American car look of the time from the 1950s. This car was actually used. It's only one produced. Här är det fråga om en stor vagn med god plats för sex personer, utrustad med automatisk växellåda och en nykonstruerad V8 motor på 120 hästkrafter. Även vad beträffar den här vagnen gäller att den bara finns i det här exemplaret som nu är ute och rullar på de svenska vägarna. Men hittar man några nykonstruktioner som visar sig matnyttiga så kommer man att utnyttja dem i serietillverkningen.